In this video, we're going to explore how to create a second floor for our second story or level two inside of the Keystone Library building. With this, I can kind of, kind of go ahead and show what we are referring to. I'm going to hide in the in the 3D view my wall here, and we have our structural steel framing that's available there to place a floor on. But yet we do not go through and have a floor in there yet. So as we go out from the green roof, we would want to make sure that we have a floor that we would need to place on the second level. To note a little bit about the thickness, I'm going to move to the south elevation. We're going to end up seeing our level 2 framing is set at 19 foot 2 inches. So our floor would sit on top of where that level is on that height. Our level two, which would represent the top of the floor, which would be level two, 19 foot six inches. So when you look at the difference between these two measurements, we're going to be using a four inch thick floor in order to put into our second story of our building. Going back to level two, this is going to be a pretty simple process. Taking the floor command, I'm going to find a floor. I'm going to use this three inch lightweight concrete on two inch metal deck and I'm going to edit the type and I'm going to duplicate. We'll call this the second floor and from here I can go ahead and hit edit structure. Within this, this has a five inches of concrete. I'm going to go ahead and show the preview. So right now this is going to go through and has two inches of of deck and if I was to hit cancel it even says the total default thickness is five inches so here we have noted that we've got five inches total and it's got the concrete with the uh, embedded in going inside of the concrete deck so here if we wanted to change that profile we could always go through and choose standalone deck but what happens here is that the concrete would sit on top of the decking which is good for a roof but not necessarily for our floor. So all I'm going to do here is change the thickness to four inches. And as I click out of there, you're going to see the thickness change in the preview. Our metal deck is included. I can go ahead and say OK. And I will say OK again. This time to place this floor, I'm going to go ahead and click on the rectangle tool. And I'm going to start up here in the upper right hand corner and where I'm going to start from is I'm going to go ahead and base it off of the corner of the beam. So the beam, so the inside of the wall because the walls are already there, are already erected. And we're just going to go through and place the floor on that. So they would not go through and be supporting these, these uh, exterior walls, but our floor would go out to them. So then I'm going to zoom out here, go down to the opposite corner this time. I want to make sure that I go down here so that way I'm going to support the entire wall on column line three as well. And so when I do that, that is going to go through and help me support the entire floor. When I do so, I hit the green check mark. If you get a message, I do not want to attach this wall to the, to the bottom. So we'll say don't attach. And then when I click off of that, here is now my concrete flooring put in. If I go back to my 3D view, here we will see here is the concrete floor that has been placed. So there is the structural steel. So you can see where the structural steel is supporting the flooring. And then the flooring here comes up to level two, which is right at the base of where these walls and everything are at. So there's no kind of overlapping of different materials and we didn't get any messages about overlapping on a lot of the components so you can kind of see the flooring does go through and do its job as it's supposed to. So second floor is installed. We do want to maybe note that on the south elevation in a subsequent, subsequent video we are going to cover that the green roof height is 20 foot four and one fourth level two's elevation height is 19 foot six inches so we're probably going to have to have a little bit of a of an elevation or step up into the green roof which later on we can go through and add some of those elements into our building but for now this completes the second floor and in another video we'll take a look at again adding some of those um, circulation pieces so dealing with stairs and an elevator as well as changing the materials for various areas of the Keystone Library.